decide where to install the Cheb. Under the bunk is usually the best location. Make sure you can safely drill holes through the floor in that space. Check the floor and below the cab for obstructions such as structural support, hydraulic, air, or electrical lines. Use the Cheb template to mark pilot holes for drilling. You must also cut three holes near the Cheb for lines and P-trap. Drill small pilot holes first to make sure bit does not hit anything. If there is a rubber mat, cut holes only through the mat that are slightly bigger than the holes needed through the cab. Use the 1 and 7 8 inch hole saw to cut two holes for the line set and electrical cord. Use the 1 and 5 8 inch hole saw to cut a hole for condensate P-trap. Use mat knife to cut out middle of snap grommets and install them into the holes in the floor. Determine best place near the Cheb location to install the return air grill. Make sure there are no cables or electrical connections behind the panel. Then measure for a hole 12.5 inches by 5.5 inches or 318 millimeters by 140 millimeters. Cut a small hole inside each corner, then use a reciprocating saw to finish a rectangular hole. Mount the return air grill with vanes pointing down. Use number 8 3 quarter inch sheet metal screws to mount the grill. Put a little light machine oil on the male threads of the line set quick connect fittings to help lubricate and make a good seal. Attach line sets to Cheb with good swift turns to minimize escape of refrigerant. Attach the drain fitting to the Cheb. Lower the Cheb into the mounting location. Make sure line sets and drain fittings align with holes already cut. Push the fan cord through the grommet of one of the larger holes. Push the two line set cables through the two grommets of the larger holes. Mount Cheb to floor using galvanized steel clips provided. Plug the fan's electrical cord into corresponding Cheb pigtail connector. Plug the ignition interlock cable into corresponding Cheb pigtail connector. Route ignition interlock cable from Cheb to fuse panel in truck dash. Hide cable behind wall panels or under floor mat. Use test light to locate an empty fuse position that provides 12 volts DC in all key positions except for off. This prevents the blizzard turbo from running while the truck engine is running. The P-trap evacuates condensate drainage and prevents outside air from entering the cab through this route. Beneath the cab, locate the 1 and 5 8 inch hole cut for the P-trap. Attach the P-trap with a 5 8 inch hose clamp. Note, the opening of the P-trap must face toward the rear of the cab.